What are the most powerful aircraft in the Brazilian Air Force? What are the incredible machines behind their impressive fleet? And how do they measure up against some of the world's most advanced military forces? Well, today we'll find out together as we're diving into the top 10 most powerful military aircraft in the Brazilian Air Force. In this list, we'll include only the best aircraft, helicopters, and unmanned aerial vehicles currently in service in the Brazilian Air Force. But before we start, which country should be next? Let us know in the comment, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell to get new military rankings every day. And now, let's jump right in. Number 10. Embraer EMB-314 the Super Tucano, known as the A-29 in Brazilian Air Force Service, is a versatile turboprop aircraft designed for light attack, close air support, counterinsurgency, and advanced pilot training. Developed by the Brazilian company Embraer, it features a single Pratt & Whitney PT-6A68C engine, providing around 1,600 horsepower. This allows the aircraft to reach a top speed of approximately 590 kilometers per hour with an operational range of over 1,500 kilometers, making it highly effective in both combat and reconnaissance missions. The Super Tucano is equipped with a robust glass cockpit featuring fourth-generation avionics, a head-up display, and an advanced human-machine interface. Its armament includes two built-in 12.7mm machine guns and provisions for a wide range of external weapons such as air-to-ground missiles, guided bombs, and rocket pods, making it a formidable platform for various missions. Number 9. Sikorsky UH-60 The Black Hawk, manufactured by Lockheed Martin in the United States, is a versatile, twin-engine, medium-lift utility helicopter. In Brazil, it serves primarily in the Brazilian Air Force and the Army, with a recent acquisition of 12 UH-60M variants. These helicopters are used for a wide range of missions, including troop transport, search and rescue, medical evacuation, and disaster relief. The UH-60M version features two General Electric T-700-GE-701D turboshaft engines, each delivering 1,940 horsepower, allowing a maximum speed of 295 kilometers per hour. Its operational range is approximately 480 kilometers, and it can carry up to 4,080 kilograms of cargo. For defense and offensive support, the helicopter is typically equipped with M134DH miniguns, capable of providing suppressive fire during missions. Number 8. EC-725H36 The Eurocopter EC-725, designated as H36 Caracol in Brazil, is a long-range tactical transport helicopter serving the Brazilian Armed Forces. Manufactured by Airbus Helicopters and assembled in Brazil by Helibris, this aircraft plays a crucial role in search and rescue, troop transport, and combat operations. Brazil initially ordered 50 units, which were distributed across the Air Force, Navy, and Army, with production taking place in Itajuba, Minas Gerais. The H-36 Caracal is powered by two Turbo Mecha Maquila, 2A1 turboshaft engines, generating around 2,382 horsepower each, enabling a top speed of approximately 324 kilometers per hour. It has a maximum takeoff weight of 11 tons and can carry up to 29 soldiers or a substantial cargo load. The helicopter is equipped with advanced avionics, self-protection systems, and can be armed with door-mounted 7.62mm or 12.7mm machine guns, making it versatile for various mission profiles. Number 7. Lockheed P-3AM the P-3AM Orion is a long-range maritime patrol aircraft currently serving in the Brazilian Air Force. Acquired from the U.S. Navy in 2006, Brazil's nine P-3 Orions were extensively modernized by Airbus Defense and Space, receiving upgrades like the fully integrated tactical system, advanced sensors, and new avionics. These enhancements allow the aircraft to conduct anti-submarine warfare, 
surface surveillance, and search and rescue missions across Brazil's vast exclusive economic zone. In 2018, Brazilian company Acair began a major wing revitalization project to extend the aircraft's operational life by replacing key structural elements. This modernization ensures the P3AM continues to monitor illegal fishing, drug trafficking, and environmental threats while protecting Brazil's maritime interests for decades to come. Number 6. Embraer C-390 The C-390 Millennium is a versatile military transport aircraft designed and manufactured in Brazil by Embraer. Currently in service with the Brazilian Air Force, it plays a critical role in strategic and tactical missions, including cargo transport, air-to-air -air refueling, and humanitarian aid. The C-390 has a maximum takeoff weight of around 87 tons and is powered by two turbofan engines, delivering a cruising speed of approximately 870 kilometers per hour. This aircraft stands out for its impressive cargo capacity, capable of transporting up to 26 tons of payload, including vehicles and troops. It features advanced avionics and a fly-by-wire control system, enhancing its maneuverability and operational efficiency. The C390 also offers a flexible cargo bay, allowing for quick reconfiguration to suit various mission requirements. Number 5. JSF-39F Gripen The F-39F Gripen, also known as Gripen E, is a cutting-edge multi-role fighter jet developed by Saab, a Swedish aerospace company, and operated by the Brazilian Air Force. This aircraft is part of Brazil's ongoing modernization of its aerial defense, with 36 units ordered, of which several have already been delivered. The F-39F variant is the two-seat version designed for advanced training and complex combat missions. Powered by a General Electric F414-GE-39E engine, the Gripen can reach speeds over 2,200 km per hour. It boasts a range of approximately 3,200 km and can operate from short and rugged airstrips, making it highly versatile in diverse environments. The jet is equipped with advanced radar, infrared search and track systems, and an electronic warfare suite that acts as an electronic shield, offering both defensive and offensive capabilities. Number 4. Northrop F-5EM The F-5EM Tiger II is a modernized variant of the American F-5E, extensively upgraded to meet the needs of the Brazilian Air Force. Initially acquired in the 1970s, the aircraft underwent significant upgrades starting in the 2000s, led by the Brazilian aerospace company Embraer. These enhancements included the integration of the Celex Grifo F radar, which improved target detection and tracking capabilities. To enhance its combat effectiveness, the F5EM was equipped with Israeli Darby medium range and Python 3 short range air to air missiles. Additionally, it features a helmet mounted display for missile targeting and a secure data link for real-time communication with airborne and ground-based radar systems. However, to accommodate the new electronics, the right-hand 20mm cannon was removed. The jet is also equipped with an in-flight refueling system, significantly extending its operational range. Number 3, a Dash 1BM. The AMMX International a Dash 1BM also known as the AMXA-1M, is a modernized light attack jet used by the Brazilian Air Force. Originally developed as a joint venture between Italy and Brazil, this single-engine aircraft has been extensively upgraded by Embraer to extend its operational life until 2032. The modernization focused on enhancing avionics, including a digital cockpit compatible with night vision goggles, a head-up display, and a helmet-mounted display. It also features an improved radar system, the SCP-01 Scipio, and upgraded communication systems. The A1M is powered by a Rolls-Royce Spey 807 turbofan engine, delivering a thrust of 49.1 kN, allowing it to reach speeds of 1,130 km per hour. Its maximum takeoff weight is 13 tons, and it can carry up to 3.8 tons of ordnance across five hardpoints. 
Number 2. Hermes 900 The Hermes 900, an unmanned aerial vehicle developed by Israel's Elbit Systems, plays a critical role in the Brazilian Air Force. It has been deployed primarily for surveillance, homeland security, and environmental monitoring, particularly over the vast Amazon rainforest. The UAV is equipped with advanced sensors, including electro-optical systems and synthetic aperture radar, enabling it to operate effectively in both day and night conditions, as well as in adverse weather. With a wingspan of approximately 15 meters and a maximum takeoff weight of over 1,000 kilograms, the Hermes 900 can stay airborne for more than 30 hours. It is powered by a Rotax 914 engine, providing a cruising speed of up to 200 kilometers per hour and a ceiling of 10,000 meters. This platform is known for its modular design, which allows for the integration of various payloads depending on mission requirements. Number 1. IAI Heron The IAI Heron is an advanced unmanned aerial vehicle currently used by the Brazilian Air Force primarily for reconnaissance, surveillance, and intelligence gathering missions. Designed and produced in Israel, the Heron offers a significant operational capability with a maximum takeoff weight of around 1,200 kilograms and an endurance of over 30 hours. It is powered by a single Rotax 914 engine, enabling it to reach altitudes of up to 10,000 meters. In Brazil, the Heron plays a critical role in monitoring the Amazon rainforest, supporting border control, and assisting in disaster response operations. Its suite of sensors includes electro-optical systems, infrared cameras, and synthetic aperture radar, making it highly versatile for various mission profiles. As we conclude our exploration of the 10 strongest military aircraft of the Brazilian Air Force, we hope you've been inspired by the power of these impressive machines. Do you agree with this list? Let us know in the comment below. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see much more military rankings like this.